Hey everybody, Jackson here, and welcome back to the channel. Today we're diving deep into the world of ethical hacking with a look at the top 10 brand new tools you need to know for 2024. We're talking fresh out of the oven, cutting edge software that will completely change your pen testing game. From recon to exploitation, we've got you covered with the latest and greatest that Kaylee Linux has to offer. So buckle up, smash that like button, and let's get started. All right. Kicking off our list at number one, we've got Amass, the subdomain enumeration monster. Now, Amass isn't exactly brand new, but it's received some killer updates in 2024 that make it an absolute must-have. We're talking about a complete overhaul of its engine, making it even faster and more efficient at uncovering those hidden subdomains. But what makes Amass so special? Well, unlike your typical subdomain scanners, Amass doesn't just rely on one source of information. It's like a bloodhound sniffing out data from search engines, certificate transparency logs, and even those juicy passive DNS databases. Think of it like this. You're trying to piece together a puzzle, and each of these sources is like a different piece. A mass meticulously gathers all these pieces, throws them together, and boom! You've got yourself a complete picture of your target's attack surface, and believe me, this is crucial. You can't very well protect yourself if you don't know what's out there, right? Amass makes sure you're not blindsided by some obscure subdomain hosting a vulnerable service. But wait, there's more. Amass also plays nicely with other tools like MassCan, which we'll be talking about later. You can easily pipe the output from Amass into MassCan to quickly scan all those discovered subdomains for open ports. It's all about that sweet, sweet synergy, people. So whether you're a seasoned bug bounty hunter or just starting out in the world of ethical hacking, do yourself a favor and add Amass to your arsenal. Trust me, you won't regret it. Next up, at number two, we've got a treat for all you mobile security enthusiasts out there, Androbugs. Now, with the explosion of mobile apps, it's more important than ever to make sure those little pockets of code we carry around are secure. That's where Androbugs comes in, your friendly neighborhood Android APK scanner. Think of Androbugs as a digital detective, meticulously combing through the nooks and crannies of your Android apps, searching for anything suspicious. We're talking about insecure coding practices, exposed components, you name it. If it could potentially lead to a data leak or some nasty unauthorized access, Androbugs will find it. But it's not just about finding vulnerabilities. Androbugs takes it a step further. It doesn't just tell you something's wrong. It gives you a detailed report like a forensic analysis, pinpointing exactly where the issue lies and what went wrong. This is invaluable for developers who can then swoop in and fix the problem before it becomes a major security headache. And let's be real, nobody wants to be responsible for their users' data ending up in the wrong hands. Androbugs helps you avoid that nightmare scenario by giving you the tools to build and maintain secure, trustworthy apps. So whether you're an app developer, a security researcher, or just someone who cares about the security of their mobile device, make sure you give Androbugs a try. Hold on to your hats, folks, because at number three, we're talking about ArchiveBox, the tool that's basically a time machine for your web recon. Ever wished you could go back in time and see what a website looked like before some critical change? Well, with ArchiveBox, you can practically do just that. Now, you might be thinking, why on earth would I need to see what a website looked like yesterday? Well, my friends, the answer is simple. Context. You see, ArchiveBox isn't just about satisfying your curiosity. It's about understanding how a target website has evolved over time. Imagine this. You're tasked with pen testing a website. You run your scans, but something seems off. You could swear there used to be a vulnerable service running on a specific subdomain, but now it's gone. What do you do? Well, if you've been diligently using ArchiveBox, you can simply rewind the clock, browse through the archived versions of the website, and boom, you've got your answer. But it's not just about finding vulnerabilities. ArchiveBox is also incredibly useful for monitoring website changes that might indicate other security issues. Did the website recently switch to a new hosting provider? Did they add a new payment gateway? These seemingly innocuous changes could actually be signs of something more sinister, and ArchiveBox helps you stay ahead of the game. All right, let's talk about Asset Finder coming in hot at number four on our list. This little tool is like that one friend who always seems to know where the party's at, except instead of parties, we're talking about domains and subdomains. See, Asset Finder is all about speed and efficiency. It's like a digital bloodhound sniffing out every single asset associated with your target from the obvious to the obscure. 
And the best part? It does it all in the blink of an eye. Now you might be thinking, why do I need another tool for finding subdomains? We already talked about a mass, and you'd be right. A mass is fantastic for a deep dive into a target's infrastructure, but sometimes you just need a quick and dirty overview and that's where Asset Finder shines. It's like the difference between using Google Maps to plan a cross-country road trip and just asking a local for directions to the nearest coffee shop. Both have their place, and Asset Finder is the perfect tool for those quick recon missions where every second counts. Plus, Asset Finder plays nicely with other tools in your arsenal. You can easily pipe its output into other tools like MassCan or NNMap for further enumeration and vulnerability scanning. It's all about that workflow optimization, baby. Hold on to your hats, folks, because at number 5, we're diving into the world of man-in-the-middle attacks with better cap we. Now I know what you're thinking. MITM attacks? That's some seriously advanced stuff. And you're right, it can be. But with better cap UI, even someone who's never touched a command line can start exploring this fascinating and slightly terrifying aspect of cybersecurity. You see, better cap itself is already a powerful tool for performing various network attacks. But let's be real, its command line interface can be a bit intimidating, even for seasoned professionals. That's where the UI part comes in. Better Cap Wii takes all that power and wraps it up in a sleek, intuitive web interface that's as easy to use as your favorite online shopping site. Suddenly, instead of wrestling with arcane commands, you're presented with a friendly dashboard where you can easily set up and launch attacks with just a few clicks. Want to sniff out some unencrypted traffic on your network? No problem, just select the appropriate options, hit start and boom, you're in business. But don't let the ease of use fool you. Better Cap Y is still a seriously powerful tool. It's like having a Swiss army knife for network attacks, allowing you to perform ARP spoofing, DNS spoofing, and even inject your own malicious code into unsuspecting users' web traffic. All right, folks, let's talk about a tool that's near and dear to my heart, DNS Recon. Coming in at number six, this little gem is like the Sherlock Holmes of DNS enumeration tirelessly digging up every last bit of information it can find about your target's domain name system. Now you might be thinking, DNS? That sounds about as exciting as watching paint dry. But trust me on this one, DNS is like the phone book of the internet. It's how your computer translates those easy to remember domain names, like google.com, into the actual IP addresses that computers use to communicate with each other. And just like a real phone book, DNS is chock full of juicy information for anyone who knows where to look. That's where DNS Recon comes in. It's like a master codebreaker, able to decipher all those cryptic DNS records and extract valuable intel about your target. We're talking about uncovering hidden subdomains, finding the email addresses of key personnel, even figuring out what kind of servers and software they're running. It's like piecing together a puzzle, and DNS Recon gives you all the pieces you need to see the bigger picture. Hold on to your hats, folks, because at number 7, we're entering the world of cloud security with Ozium Privesk. Now, with more and more companies moving their infrastructure to the cloud, it's more important than ever to make sure those environments are locked down tight. And when it comes to AWS, the 800-pound gorilla of cloud services, IAM, Identity and Access Management, is your first line of defense. But here's the thing. IAM can be a real beast to manage. With its complex policies and granular permissions, it's easy to misconfigure something and accidentally give someone more access than they should have. And that's where Ozam Privesk comes in, your trusty sidekick for navigating the treacherous terrain of AWS IAM. Think of it like a security audit on steroids. Ozam Privesk digs deep into your IAM configuration, sniffing out any potential privilege escalation vulnerabilities. It's like having a bloodhound on your team, meticulously searching for any loose ends that an attacker could exploit to gain unauthorized access. But Aosium Privesk isn't just about finding vulnerabilities, it's about understanding the how and the why. It doesn't just tell you something's wrong, it explains exactly how an attacker could exploit a particular misconfiguration and what they could potentially gain access to. All right, folks, let's get back to our mobile security routes with AppCleaks, coming in at number eight on our list. Now, we already talked about AndroBugs, which is fantastic for finding general vulnerabilities in Android apps, but AppCleaks is like that super specialized detective you bring in when you need to find those hidden gems. 
those secrets buried deep within the code. You see, even the most well-intentioned developers can sometimes make mistakes. They might accidentally hard-code API keys, authentication tokens, or other sensitive information directly into their app's code. And while this might seem harmless at first glance, it's like leaving the keys to your kingdom lying around for anyone to pick up. That's where AppCliques comes in. It's like a digital bloodhound, trained to sniff out those hard-coded secrets that could give an attacker the keys to the kingdom. It scans through your app's code, looking for anything that looks even remotely suspicious, and then presents you with a neat little report highlighting its findings. Hold on to your hats, folks, because at number 9 we're talking about Mass Can, the speed demon of port scanning. Now, every self-respecting ethical hacker knows the importance of port scanning. It's like knocking on the doors of a network to see who's home and what services they're running. But traditional port scanners, while effective, can sometimes be a bit slow, especially when you're dealing with large networks or even entire IP ranges. That's where Mass Can comes in. It's like strapping a rocket engine to your port scanner allowing you to cover an insane amount of ground in a fraction of the time it would take traditional tools. We're talking about scanning the entire internet in just a few minutes. Now you might be thinking, wow, that's insane. Why would I ever need to scan the entire internet? And you're right, in most cases you won't. But for researchers, security professionals, or anyone who needs to quickly get a lay of the land, MassCan is an invaluable tool. And last but certainly not least, coming in at number 10, we have the Harvester, your go-to tool for open-source intelligence, OSINT gathering. Now, in the world of ethical hacking and penetration testing, information is king. The more you know about your target, the better equipped you are to identify and exploit vulnerabilities. But gathering that information isn't always easy. You could spend hours, even days, manually sifting through search engine results, social media profiles, and other publicly available sources. Or, you could let the Harvester do the heavy lifting for you. Think of the Harvester as your personal team of digital detectives, tirelessly scouring the internet for any scrap of information related to your target. We're talking about email addresses, subdomains, employee names, social media profiles, you name it. If it's publicly available, the Harvester will find it. But the Harvester doesn't just gather information, it organizes it into a neat little report, making it easy for you to digest and analyze. This is crucial for connecting the dots and identifying potential attack vectors. And there you have it, folks. Our top 10 new hacking tools on Kali Linux for 2024. From subdomain enumeration to cloud security and everything in between, these tools will give you the edge you need to stay ahead of the curve. Remember, with great power comes great responsibility. Use these tools ethically and responsibly to make the digital world a safer place. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on future cybersecurity adventures. Until next time, stay curious, stay ethical, and most importantly, stay secure.